I'm on Five Mile Road near Farmington Road in Livonia, where these branches have had the westbound lanes blocked for several hours. Just some of the damage we've come across tonight. There's a few branches here and there, but I think this is the biggest one that that came down and from what I see in our area. In Livonia, a big branch from a tree across the street from Kim Gonzalez's house fell onto her pickup truck this evening, smashing the back window, potentially putting a damper on her upcoming camping trip. On top of that, right now we have no power, along with some of her neighbors and drivers dealing with powerless traffic lights. On Five Mile, Livonia police made sure no one ran into this large branch across half the road, an act of Mother Nature forcing drivers to turn around or cut through the neighborhood. The same scene not far away on Newburg Road, where this tree blocked Richfield Street. But Livonia is not alone. Over in Chesterfield, Lynn Ely shared these photos showing several large branches that fell onto her home, and she says some of them damaged the roof of her chicken coop. And over in Gross Point, westbound Lakeshore closed because of a fallen tree across the roadway. Like Ely, Gonzalez says the storm caught her off guard. I even looked at my phone and I'm like, you know, we were only getting the outside of it. And next thing you know, uh, like I said, the wind came and the damage. And remember, if you see a down power line, stay away and call DTE. That number is 1-800-477-4747. In Livonia, Darren Cunningham, 7. Action News. Certainly a good reminder. Thank you so much, Darren. Now, now is the time to download the 7 Action News app if you have not done so already, so you can stay on top of any new alerts and track the rain with the interactive radar.